I'm gonna throw up. We can't maybe not. Isn't it funny how when athletes and fitness influencers train really hard, they use that as a platform to tell people, if I can do it, you can do it. But if you didn't work out today, and you haven't left your comfort zone in a long time, I don't blame you, dog. That sucks, man. If I didn't have the goalposts of the cage fight out in front of me, I'd be watching TV, man. Oh, fuck that. Fight vlog, day one. It is fight week. It's fucking cold, boys. Woke up this morning at 175 pounds. Fights at 160. So I will exercise and diet another five pounds off for now until Wednesday. It's getting harder to find these pounds though. I started at 190 and I'm running pretty lean as it is. The thing I've enjoyed most about being part of the MMA community is having access to the world behind the curtain. And that's what I'm sort of hoping to capture this week, if not just for me and my own memories and video diary in the future for everybody else to see what goes into prepping for fight week for myself specifically pretty much every day my mornings start out here at vibe just prepping and setting up for the day getting the espresso machine ready getting the coffee on writing the daily message on the chalkboard sign putting it out and then setting up the studio for a day full of guided meditation classes. Starting this business and running it alongside my real estate business and being a husband, being a father, it's definitely put a lot on my plate, but there's no denying that heading into this fight, this atmosphere and this place has paid dividends as far as my mental clarity, anxiety, and stress, all the stimulus that we have in our day-to-day -day lives and learn to slow down and find stillness, connect with the breath. That's definitely made a big difference during this training camp and in preparation for this fight. This community chalkboard wall was one of the first ideas that I actually had when we were designing this space. I knew that it was something that we needed to have. I encourage everybody that comes in to either sign in with their name or a message, or favorite quote, whatever they feel called to contribute. It's been awesome walking along week by week and noticing more and more. The minute I put the final coat on this and it dried, I actually made the first contribution to the board right here. This is the first thing ever written on this board. Sorry, it wasn't more profound. Well, that's the day at Vibe. Now heading home to have the smallest bit of food and hop on the elliptical and sweat off hopefully a couple pounds. It is an ice box in this car. I definitely think I'm going to be heavier than I've been telling myself and you that I am. Pre-workout and I had food today. So calm down. All right, not great. 178.8. Kind of fat. I was hoping it'd be like 175. Ooh, okay. Getting a lot of water 
Carrying a lot of dad fat. Better than 189. I was 189 recently. How heavy did I get? Do you remember? No. Captain America. Air Force. 178.8. So after one hour of cardio, what do you think I'll be at? 176. 176. Yeah, it's about two pounds last time. I'll go for more. Don't pass out. No, that'll be, that's Wednesday slash Thursday. It's whatever, at the end of the day, I'm gonna make weight. Which is, the more I do right now, the less it's gonna suck. Uh, let's go. I'm actually gonna opt for a political podcast on this one. To be honest, when I first started training for this fight, I had a completely different opponent that was actually not that good. And I was conflicted by that because on the one hand, I don't want to just beat somebody up. I replaced my opponent with a younger, way more athletic, fighter named Dan Kovalchuk. And he's seven and three as an amateur with an amateur title, so he's pretty good. He's fought and been active quite a bit more recently than I have. But I'm the old man in this fight. I've been doing this for a lot longer, so I'll be able to get it done. He is a purple belt in jiu-jitsu from what I've seen. And as much as I'd rather keep this one on the feet for showmanship's sake and putting on a good show, I'm not too worried about a purple belt. I deal with them all the time. All the windows are fogging up. Eight minutes left. Eating popcorn and Skittles. And watching Stranger Things with the girls. It would bring me so much more joy. Five minutes left. Last round. Who wants it more? Who fucking wants it? Ah. Finish. Fuck. So it says. Fresh out of the shower. Y'all want to know a dirty little secret I've never told anybody? My skincare routine, every day, is done by my wife. She volunteers. She started doing it. Never stopped. Oops. Little finger in the nose. <laughs> Small price to pay. I see your arm. Should have grabbed your beard stuff. Mmm. You know what I found out today? Hmm. Is that they are streaming the fights on fight.tv. F I T E. So they can watch it? Mm hmm. Yeah. Wait, that's really soon. Your fight is like a couple days away. Yeah, dude. Not weeks, days. Gross. Yeah. Friday night. <laughs> Scary.